He had like, a bad press conference. Let's just be clear. At the end of the day, he has wanted to do this his entire life. He built an incredible company. He was able to take a lot of that capital and invested in it. He's invested billions of dollars in other things, $10 billion in climate change. His ex-wife has invested, you know, $6 billion just last year alone in all kinds of good works. So those two individuals, because of their success, I think will generally do and have done the right thing. Let's not get that confused with a horrendous press conference where he just put Why his foot was it in his horrendous? Mouth. Well, I think you said it, you know, the, the thing that he said around, uh, you know, I just want to thank the customers and the employees for paying for this. It sounded flippant and it didn't really acknowledge the incredible amount of heavy lifting and hard work that he did acknowledge in the clip from 2000 on Charlie Rose, right? So if you, if you actually played those two things ba back side by side, you'd say, is this the same person? One was thoughtful, extremely respectful. The other one was, now maybe he was just amped up. I mean, I could see how I he could be- I think that's what I think. He was super he was high, really absolutely on cloud nine, so to speak. You know, yeah. and so, and so he just wasn't thinking about it, but you know, honestly, like, look, he is smart enough and that team is smart enough to say, we're assuming you're coming back. So here's some fucking talking points. Why don't you just look at those on the way down as you float down to earth and let's just make sure we nail this and put our best foot forward. That is where I think he probably has some regrets based on how people react.